This is Mandy Rockefeller. I'm standing outside the home in Driggs, the duplex. I am actually facing east, so this is the entry to the street. You can see the properties to the south, and then the park is actually beyond um, that those houses. And then panning around to the north. You'll see the northern unit. We're going to go on the southern unit first. Um, units appear to be in good condition. There's some deferred maintenance. You can see like the paint is sort of peeling a little bit from the siding, but overall from the front, the exterior appears to be in good condition. Uh, each car has a garage, and then there's an entryway um, for both units, so they are separated by the garage. If you see that building to the north, the brown one that is Gucci Bird building, which fronts on Little Avenue or Ski Hill Road. So we're going to walk in the southern unit first. Walking in to the main living area here, you've got uh, tile flooring, and we'll turn to the left. There's a half bath and a water heater, and then also the laundry is located in this. Space. Oh, excuse me, three-quarter bath. There's a shower. I forgot about that. So shower here. And opening the shower. Shower appears to be in good condition. Not needing any repair. Um, laundry, washer dryer, full size. Cadet in-wall heater. And then uh, backing out of this room. Again, this is also tiled. Uh, we'll go to the main living area and kitchen. So, a uh, garage door, and the door is locked, so I'm not going to open it at this time. This is a closet here under the stairs. So, um, panning back, that's the front door that you can see. And then we have the kitchen area. We have fridge, washer, or excuse me, fridge and range, but I don't see a dishwasher in this unit. So that is something to be aware of. Looking out the back door, you'll see uh, a deck. And there appears to be no separating fences between the two units. Uh, and it appears that the western boundary of the property is where you see those fence posts. So access to the backyard is through this door. Scroll panning back around the main living area here to the front door, storage under the stairs, garage. Going upstairs, Uh, stairs are carpeted. They appear to be in good condition, although they do need to be cleaned, in my opinion. Um, at the top of the landing to the right is a large bedroom. Carpeted flooring. Again, carpet appears to be in fine condition. I think it just needs to be cleaned. Then we have our second bedroom upstairs. So there's a large closet. And a good sized bedroom here. Light fixtures. And then full bath upstairs, so you've got your tub shower combo, um, vanity, tiled flooring. And then um, coming into the third bedroom, which is actually east facing now, you've got um, some built-ins here and more built-ins here for closet space. And then I'll pan around this room. You can see got your light fixture there. 
and then um, carpeted flooring. So this room appears to be a little more stained than the others. I'm not sure if um, simply cleaning it will suffice, but I would certainly try. Um, one other thing to be aware of, there is a, a missing spot, uh, some carpet repair is needed, but not the end of the world by any means. So walking back down, I'll show you the stairs from the top. So those are the stairs back out to the front door. So this is the walkthrough of the southern unit in, um, in Driggs for the duplex.